Hello guys and welcome to another Java tutorial and this time I am going to be doing a little exercise. Uh, the other days I was just going to my old um, college textbooks for Java and I found this interesting exercise and I decided to share it with you guys. So imagine if somebody hires you, I don't know, an online um, company that is selling items like Amazon or something like that and they want you to create a program that will allow the user or the administrator to enter the an, a price of an item and the program what needs to be, do is is basically um, include the percentage of uh, the market price and the taxes so let's start by creating a class this is really easy so it's a, it's a small program so I won't take too long so we write the name of the class as markup and tax click on public static boy main click finish first thing we need to do is import the java util okay let's get rid of this comment and let's actually for the scanner let's um let's actually do a static Scanner and let's call it console new scanner. Actually, I forgot the new right here. Parameter system dot in semicolon. And now what we need to do is finalize the two variables. We need the variable for the percentage the markup price and the taxes so what we need to do is we need to finalize this let's declare it as a double and we got to write the markup and let's give it a value of say I don't know 10% that's a 10% markup markup on the item we finalize this time the the tax and let's give it a value of I don't know 6% I know different states have different um, sales taxes so now what we need to do is declare three more variables in this case an item um, the cost of the item and the markup of the item so wait a minute should i do tax uh, yes i think i should do tax not cost so let's do tax instead and here let's write the um the prompt so let's say enter item pr um, price and here we include the console uh, method so we need to write item and console which is the keyword here we write next double par uh, parameter and semicolon and at the bottom right here what we need to do oops, is do the calculation so tax equals the item times the tax okay that will calculate the tax of the item and the bottom here let's do markup equals um, the item times the markup price so let's just actually let's just copy paste this kind of lazy this morning a little tired and let's do the printouts actually let me just write this on the bottom and let's say the tax of the item is and this right here um, plus tax okay that will give us the tax of the item here we're gonna do the the markup the markup price is the markup price basically is what um, the percentage they they increase the item so they can make a profit everybody does that so okay so let's hear this um, the final um, price of the item is and here Actually, let me leave, let me do it here at the bottom. So we need to add the item 
um, plus the tax plus the markup okay let's do this let's eliminate the the end line we don't need it and this two lines so the code looks nicer so you can see me expand it a little bit so let's run this okay actually I gotta spend this again so let's say and it says right here enter item price so say I don't know twenty dollars so there you have it the tax of the item is one dollar and twenty cents the marker price is two dollars and the final price which includes the marker price and the tax is twenty three dollars and twenty cents so there you have it really easy code very easy code this is basically um, basic Java so what the, the, this does is we calculate this percentage of the marker price with the item and this percentage of the tax with the item and it gives us here what's the percentage of each and it includes everything on the finalized price let's run this again with a different price actually let's say $35 so there you have it the tax of the item is two dollars and ten cents and the market price is three dollars and fifty cents and the final price is forty dollars and sixty cents so I, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video and learned something and I'll be coming back to with another video later bye